Jessica Loganer is the National Director of Animal Crimes for the Humane Society of the United States. She testified today at Christina Fay's animal cruelty trial that she witnessed Fay being taken into custody. Um, did you make observations about her that morning? I did. What were those? That um, the, her clothing was, was covered in what appeared to be feces. Faye faces several misdemeanor charges after dozens of Great Danes were taken from her home in Wolfboro this past summer. Loganer told the judge that when they walked through the property, one of the things that struck her was the overpowering smell of ammonia. It was very difficult to breathe. Um, my eyes were burning, my nose was burning, my chest was burning. There was multiple times where I had to step out and take a breath before continuing inside of, of the residence. But defense lawyers suggested things were not as they appeared and produced binders filled with hundreds of veterinary records that they say show the dogs were well cared for. But prosecutors called Dr. Monique Kramer, who helped seize the dogs and cared for them afterward. She testified the dogs suffered from a variety of physical problems that included eye infections and sores on their bodies and mouths. And, and one dog I remember distinctly um, uh, was a Harlequin Dane that was covered in blood like all along the side of her body and the end of her tail. Defense lawyers also suggested the police treated this like a drug sting and simply wondered why they didn't talk to Faye about the allegations. Testimony will continue tomorrow afternoon. Reporting live in Ossipee, I'm Andy Hirschberger, WMUR News 9.